For many manufacturing companies, the time it takes to change a manufacturing line to make a different product has been considered a necessary evil, a cost of doing business. Depending on the complexity of the process, a product changeover can take from hours to days. Regardless of the process, however, there are some things that changeovers have in common. First, long changeovers lower machine capacity. Second, the startup of a different product produces scrap and rework as the machine is being fine-tuned. Third, because of the time changeovers typically take, conventional wisdom says it is more cost-effective to produce in larger lot sizes. But what if your company could set up or change over your equipment in a fraction of the time it now takes? What kind of benefit would that be to your company? What kind of benefit would that be to your customers? The first step in understanding how setup reduction can help your company is to figure out exactly how long your changeovers take today. Michael Beauregard, Director of Technology for Resource Engineering Incorporated, describes what setup time is. And I define that as the time it takes from when you shut down the machine from making one production run, so the last piece off of the line or the last pound off the line, to when you get the first piece of the first pound coming out that's good. Most companies that implement setup reduction do it as part of an overall lean manufacturing strategy. These days, companies are trying to implement lean manufacturing to be more responsive to their customers. And setup reduction is one of the key tools that makes it so you can be fast, you can be flexible, so you can be responsive. It enables you to do the short runs at the lowest cost. In addition to greater flexibility and responsiveness, setup reduction can generate significant bottom line benefits to a company, often with little or no capital investment.